Today we're gonna look at the mobile whiteboard by USA Creative Space. Here's the unboxing. So you get several magnets. Eraser. You also get a ruler. And this is the middle part. Or you can put the magnets and the eraser and everything. Here's some more components. And so I'm just gonna go through each one. That way you see you can see what all the components are and what's included in the package. Later on in the video, I'll go I'm gonna demonstrate how to build it step by step. All right, so in step one, we're gonna do the wheel. And so you can just lock it in with the tool. And just keep uh, rotating. Make sure it's nice and tight. Here we're gonna do step two. And so I'm just building this by myself, so if you have a partner, it'll probably be easier just to do it. But I'm just showing how to do it with one by yourself. And this is the best angle I could I figured out to do the second step. And all the tools are included in the package. Here's step three. And so you just wanna make sure that they're all tight. Found the best way just to put the actual screws, the tool first and then inserting it and then just tightening. Okay, so this is step four. Now, this was a little tricky, doing it by myself. 
I must admit, but I uh, once I figured it out, I recorded it. Now this whole process to build the actual whiteboard probably takes uh, 20 minutes if you're doing it by yourself because uh, you're having to juggle all the parts and make sure they're straight. I'm sure probably if you do it with a partner, it probably takes 10, 15 minutes or less. Step five, so I'm just putting this middle piece and that's what's gonna hold the whiteboard at the bottom. And so you just take your time screwing in, don't over screw. So this is step six, and so I'm just placing it. First I place it on the bottom, and then I do the sides. Step seven, you're gonna to wanna to tighten it, the sides. So you wanna make sure you do it right and make sure it's not too tight. Now I forgot to show this part, but this is uh, technically step seven before you do it. But anyways, this is the side. So you just go and screw it.
you know, I might over screw it because the whiteboard, the inside is actually wood and you can damage it. Here we have step nine. So you just want to cover the holes. Some of the features, you can lock the wheels. Uh, the whiteboard's magnetic. You can spin the whiteboard different angles for your preference. One great use we found for whiteboards for games, like Pictionary, and to keep score different scores. We have over probably like 150 board games, so this is a great whiteboard for that. Also for teaching my son. So my son's in fourth grade. And finally for any business aspect so I do a lot of YouTube videos so I'm always planning uh, what I'm gonna do next and so this is a great tool for that and I hope this uh, video helps you in your buy decision process if you like this video please click like and subscribe